Hop the Magic Dragon. You know what? I haven't played that on camera yet. Your characters with support gain an additional plus two, plus one. Echo Wood is so viable in so many different strategies. It's viable in evil. It's viable in slay. It's viable in dwarves. It's viable in good. It's viable in triants. It's... Oh. Uh... The only thing I don't want is Kitty Cut Purse. <laughs> you butt. <laughs> yeah! Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. I'm actually going to lock that. The Kitty Cup Purse has a ability of when you slay, gain plus one gold. Unfortunately, you only slay when you attack the enemy, not when they attack you. Okay. So I've taken the Mad Mim, which is a support unit. Support gives plus three attack. However, my hero also gives a supported unit plus two plus one. So Kitty Cup Purse gets rather large. Uh, I mean, look, I wanted to have a happy little tree so that I could just sit it behind one of these units, but I'm not locking for it here. We're far past that. So yeah, uh, and what, what's another example? Sad Dracula is weird in that there are a bunch of treasures that are related to slays that are so good for him that he feels like he's a high roll, low roll champion. Like you either get them or you don't. It's, it's that kind of binary. Do you win or not? Uh, you know, there's, there's some, definitely some heroes in there that feel underpowered as well. Hmm. I think I'm going to roll this one. I'll take the kitty, I'll take the roll. And then I think I'm going to dig again looking for another kitty. I'll take kitty or support pretty happily. Do I take a dwarf support? No, I don't. I don't. I'm going to take a polywog and hold it in hand. I have Mad Mim to be able to support its uh, damage stats. Polywoggle is slay. I transform into a character that's one level higher than your hero. I'm not putting it on the board right now because I want a level four character, not a level three character. Um, so it's going to get plus three damage from Mad Mim and it's going to get plus two damage from Pop the Magic Dragon. So it should, by all rights, this early on in the game, be able to kill something. Wait, the mage. What are you, my housemate? He says Poggy Woggy too. He's actually how I was introduced to it, despite the fact that I, uh, you know, work on Twitch. <laughs> um, interesting. So, this is kind of a soft synergy. But the Hungry Hungry Hippocampus... When you buy or summon an animal, gain plus one health permanently. It's going to function very well with summoning a bunch of animals in the middle of a fight. And summoning the bunch, uh, a bunch of animals in the middle of a fight is also very good with your, uh, your support units behind them. Because then they actually become appreciably useful units. So yeah, I'll take that. I'll also take Cat's Call. Your front row, when it's emptied, is filled with 1-1 one, one cats. I should have. Should have? Shouldn't have? Oh, come on! It's not supposed to have seven health. I'm pretty sure that's illegal. I've done some maths about it. I'm certain that's illegal. Tweedle D and Fanny behind it would actually be pretty good, but I'm going to take Good Witch of the North, hit the Forbidden Fruit for plus one gold, take two damage, and then I'm rolling, 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 rolling. I don't lock a Polywoggle. That can be my board. 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 And that's my board. What does the upgraded Polywoggle do? Uh, it transforms into an upgraded character. It's, it's really good, but it's not worth locking here. 
If I, you know, rolled past it and I had just two extra gold sitting around, I'd take it, though. Okay. Potion Master's also really good, but I don't think this person's been cast in a bunch of spells. We've got an animal mage that's only got one buff on. Slave for experience? Oh, am I going to get another experience, Slay? I am! See ya, nerd! I'm level five. Four, four. I'm level four now. You're still a nerd, though. Uh, ooh, baby. <gasps> oh, Polywoggle transformed! Oh. So we've got a level five rotten apple tree already out. Do I... Do I pivot to Triance? This is a Triance support unit here. I think I pivot to Treance. I should look for another Treant. A three cost Treant? No. No, I'm looking for the Heartwood Elder if I can find it. So I couldn't find it there. Do I continue rolling down? I think I do. I think I am going to pivot for Trounce. So. Yeah. Other things are just not as useful. Actually. Do I transfer now? Because that's a permanent buff. No. It's too much to sell. Easy asks, where do you get do X about it? That's a great question. I know I got it from somewhere. I cannot remember for the life of me where. But I, I, I know it was uh, an influence from either a, a podcast or a, a, a stream series or a sketch show or something. It could be Hollywood Handbook. A lot of a lot of my stuff. A lot of my uh, unique phraseology comes from Hollywood Handbook in some way. Mm -hmm. I need another trio. Maybe I should have just accepted the happy little friend. Maybe I'll take that. Actually, it might be time to sell. One, two, three. You're never going to get a slay if you're off the board. The hippocampus is more stats. But I think I sell the adventurer. If it gets... No, but if the... I, I'm leaving the adventurer with a possibility of getting a slay this round. If it gets a slay this round, we're good. And then I can sell it later. But also, if it... Doesn't get a slay this round, then I kind of need to hold it again. Ugh. I do want to sell the princess, but the thing is, I want to get to six as quickly as possible with this build as well. Hit right, hit right, hit right, hit right, hit right, hit right. Right, 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 E legal. Rude and illegal. It's a one in three to have hit the wrong one there. Yeah, Echo Wooden Round Table are the uh the endpoints for a Triant build. Broccoli doesn't even have to be involved. That's so rude. Is there no method to targeting in this game? Not that I'm aware of, no. The method seems to be it will always hit the worst unit for it to hit. Baby Bear is actually like really good stats in this position. But I think I have to continue hard rolling for, for trees if I want to actually get this build to get off the ground. I need some treasures, you know. 
not taking plus two damage on you this round. You can also cast another spell. No. Man, I do like two puff buffs. I see. I see. Level two and three characters no longer appear in our shop. We have nothing on board though. <sighs> yeah, I was never gonna get a kill. We can sell the princess now though. Nice try. Thank you, Art and uh, Applebaum for just being a boss. Uh oh. Okay, it didn't summon a ridiculous amount of units. We're okay. We're okay. Uh, now I just need to get some power back on my board. So I'm just going to drop a Wombats in Disguise and that. And sell you and get a Poison Apple. Yeah. This is fine. Ish. As long as I don't take 11 damage in the next round, we're fine. We have the ability to pull up from a nosedive pretty hard with some units. Uh, I think the only loss with the staff is the O3 that buffs on survive damage. Uh, the Ashwood Elder or whatever it's called. Yeah. That's... That's not great, but the thing is, as soon as you hit level 6 and you can get the uh, the level 6 evil triant that gives its health as damage to all other triants on the field, you no longer really care about the Darkwood Creeper. It's really good early scaling if you can get it. There's very few things I love more than having Darkwood Creeper and Ring of Meteors. Ring of Meteors is a two-cost treasure that at the start of combat deals one damage to all units. So you just give all of your units plus one attack permanently at the start of the battle, or plus two attack permanently at the start of the battle, or you know, however many Darkwood Creepers you have to have. Happen to have, rather. Okay. Hopefully the Wombats in Disguise summon something reasonable here. Nice. Steal those stats. Oh. I want that later. <laughs> this later. Not now. Oh, boy. Okay. At least the broccoli is on lower HP now. I'm dead, aren't I? No, 10. Okay. <sighs> Oh, but. No. Flip. Well, we have to hard pivot back. You literally don't get a choice right there. But. Oh, and we're, fight we're fighting Wonder Waddle. We're probably screwed. So how would I not be screwed? Uh, this dies and summons a good unit. Yeah, I've got the ranged unit here in the back line. A ranged unit hits an enemy without taking damage back. Uh, it's going to be benefiting from the stats from both of the good boys. It's, look, it's not awful. It's not awful. But if I had one more good unit, I'd feel a lot better. Why the second pivot? Uh, it, it was more powerful than I was likely to be able to get by hard rolling down and finding an Ashwood Elm. 
My mistake in this game is I needed more units on board. The turn where I actually sold four units to pick up the final uh, Apple Balm, I think that was my mistake. Wombats can't summon Wombats. Wombats can only summon level sixes, of which Wombat is not one. Ooh, good hit. Ooh, big stretches. Oh, how? Oh, I mean, Yorman Garden is actually getting pretty good. I think we're fine. Nice. All right, we're fine. We're fine. Now I just need to take good units. Oh, uh, Baron Stain? Actually, I can also use Beauty's Influence to turn the evil character good so I can get the Rotten Apple Bomb. You're good too? We just got hard bailed out. Y'all, I cannot tell you how hard of a bailout that was. Uh, so what are my next upgrades? Isn't that the Treant we want? We're outside of Treant strategy now. We're instead going for good synergy. I could take that and then try and look for a beauty's influence in the future. Um, but it's it's a lot less impactful than in uh, this moment if I find a baby bear? Three big pigs is actually also really good. Uh, one, two. One, two, take the pigs. One, two, take the pigs. Fix that. Yep. So we took the pigs because they have a last breath summon three five five pigs. The pigs that it summons are animals. Uh, and Berenstain here says your animals have plus two plus two. When you summon an animal during a brawl, double its attack and health. So when these are summoned, they will be eight eights because of the, uh, sorry, seven sevens because of the plus two plus two from Berenstain. And then that'll double, so they'll become a 14 14. Gets a lot of stats on board. Big. Yeah, this person's trying to go do good boys as well, but they're slower than I am. To be fair, I hit six experience and immediately found two good boys. It's hard to be faster than I am right now. I can get uh, a treasure straight out of Lancelot. I can just take Lancelot to get a treasure. Do I care about tripling this lady? No. Oh, he's, he slayed my good boy with a siren. That's how he got his. Right, right, right. Sorry, I didn't see that. Oh. Oh, sheesh, y'all. This is still providing a lot of stats that get transferred from the good boys, but... Oh, where does Hercules go right now? It's got to be there, right? Seven through, seven through. Maybe you go there, you go there. Something like that. It's like that. <sighs> I think Lancelot is a hard debate. Uh, the reason Lancelot's not a debate in this point is because I'm not slaying it. Oh, I'm not using it to slay in order to increase its stats to get its quest done. I'm just using the good boy's death to do it. So one of these dies gives seven stats to the other. This has 14. So this has got seven and 14. We get 21, 21 overall when the front board dies, unless they have their stats changed. The Hercules has a quest, I can deal 100 damage. So as long as it deals 100 damage, we'll be fine. Dealt 20 right there. Kill the good boys, please. I need them to die. <laughs> Thank you. Gosh. Wow. Hercules might actually trigger in this round. Oh. 
Oh, Lancelot. Of course, then the good boy dies. Yeah, of course, of course. As long as, yeah, Hercules tree is, never mind. We get a six cost treasure. I'm pretty happy about that. <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> Hard synergy. Level two and three characters no longer appear in the shop. Told you he's a bait. That still doesn't make him a bait, my man. Uh, person. Sorry. We get the embiggening scone. The characters that don't show in our shop have plus 15, plus 15. Also, like, the vibe of just constantly telling me I'm wrong and then telling me that it's, it's just not a good vibe. You could even be entirely right, and it still wouldn't be a good look. Take the Elmwood, because whenever another character gains uh, attack or health during a brawl, so will it. Um, I'll just take the plus one, plus one to everything forever. Okay, there's our 1919. Good boy attack Hercules. Hercules attack good boy. Lancelot attack good boy? Lancelot treasure. It took me two rounds to get a Lancelot treasure. Two rounds for, five fives, uh, for a level five treasure is pretty good. I find Spear can get awkward pretty some, uh, sometimes when your good boys don't die. You're not? Ooh. At the start of your brawl, upgrade your last character for this brawl only. So that's going to get our Baron Stains immediately upgraded, or it's going to get our Echo Woods immediately upgraded. That's the case may be right now. Lancelot can go out of the party. It literally only mattered for that. Ooh, I can transform Hercules into a different six cost. Eh, do I care about Doom Breath? I could care about Doom Breath. Karen, do you have a good uh, backline? Possibly. Baron Stain doesn't really want to be out on the board. <sighs> hmm. Oh, oh, good minions. No, I have to do it that way. This was right initially. I guess in case we tie. I'll lock here. I held Doom Breath off the board because I think I get more stats just by scaling. Okay. Oh, thank heck that was your Polymorph target. Whew! Okay, your apple bomb is down. Uh, we're... <sighs> it's all over but the crying here. I'll do it. C-Labs asks, is this the new update to Hearthstone Brawl or a different game? I haven't been rolling it much, lo uh, lol. Uh, this is not Hearthstone. Uh, this is a, uh, a game made by a group of independent developers, some of which had previously worked at Blizzard. We did it! That's the, the bailout builds when you, you, know, you, 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 your water is taking, you, your water rather, you, 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 your ship is taking on water. You're noticing that it's starting to get a little side heavy. It's starting to capsize a little bit. And uh, you immediately plug up the leak with, uh, I'm going to say a peg leg. We're pirates in this scenario, by the way. That's very important. We're pirates in this scenario. You stop taking on water and you sail the harbor.
One health is all rap needs. You're not wrong. One health. See? The only health point that matters. <laughs>